What's up, YouTube? <laughs> that always startles everybody. <laughs> How long did you stay in the pen for? I did four and a half. Four and a half? And what was that for? Beating somebody with a hammer. You say what? Beating somebody with a hammer. <laughs> oh, shit. You beat somebody with a hammer? Yeah. What's up, YouTube? Back in the lab with KD for the summertime. And this time, I got my hitters with me. If you want to get this work, hit up at KD with the muscle on Instagram. Now, back to the content. What's up, YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> that always startles everybody. <laughs> okay. Okay, come on. What's up, YouTube? Atlanta Street Interviews, out here with another one. So we got a young lady with us today. How you doing today, miss? Okay. Okay, okay, and so um, are you homeless? So much homeless. Okay, and so how old are you? I'm 38. 38? And so how long have you been homeless? Uh, approximately, I came home December 21st. You say December? December? Okay. I'm gonna finish the swap, man. Homeline, what? Three, four months? About six months. Four About months. six months, and so, um, how long did you stay in the pen for? Uh, I did four and a half. Four and a half? And what was that for? Beating somebody with a hammer. You say what? Beating somebody with a hammer. <laughs> oh shit. You beat somebody with a hammer? Yes. Wh who'd you beat with a hammer? A friend of mine that I was dealing with. You say a friend of yours? Speak up a little bit for me. A dude that I was dealing with. Okay, so this was a romantic partner. I had my sister. Okay, you miss, why did you beat him with a hammer? Come on now, nah, because that nigga stole my rent money. <laughs> he stole your rent money? Yeah. And so when you beat him with a hammer, what was the damage? <laughs> that nigga had knots in his head. Oh shoot! Okay, so he didn't. You didn't kill him or anything like no, that. No, it was like a. It was like a assault and battery. Like okay, okay, okay. So you did four and a half of that. Yeah. Was that your first time in the pen? No. No. Um, how old were you the first time that you went to the? Uh, they 17. went to prison. Seventeen. What was that for? Uh, stabbing my best friend. You say stabbing your best friend with a crack pipe? Yeah. With a crack pipe. And alone, yes. Wait, all right. Why did you stab your best friend with a crack pipe? Because we was fighting, and at that time, I was getting high. And I had it in my hand. And so you had already been smoking crack at that point? Yeah. Okay. What age was the first age that you smoked crack? Uh, that's me. 21. Well, you just said at 17 you went to I prison. I was 17. For... I was in prison. Yeah. No, no, no. You said that you went to prison at 17. Oh, yeah. You're right. You're right. <laughs> you were stabbing. I was smoking. But, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. I was 17, you okay. I was 17. Okay, okay. All right, so let's just... <laughs> you got okay. me, hold on, wait, yeah. It's okay. So do, do you have any kids? Yeah, I How many? Four. four. And so how old is the oldest? How young is the youngest? <laughs> my oldest is 19. My youngest is 12. Okay, okay. And by the way, what year were you born? 86. 86. Okay, yeah, you're 38. You're 38. Okay, okay. Yes, sir. <laughs> my boy. Yeah, <laughs> that was crazy. Hey, so yeah, they know me out here. All right, all right. So okay, so okay, so <laughs> all right, all right. So oldest is nineteen, youngest is how old? Oh my god, twelve. Twelve. Okay. Yes. Um, same dad or different dads? They all got different. They all got different dads. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so nineteen. So that sounds like you had your first child around eighteen or nineteen. Mm -hmm. well, you huh? You can say it. I can say that? Mm -hmm. Is that the truth? It's around that time. Yeah. Around that time? Okay. All right. So, I mean, according to your timeline, your stuff be messed up anyway. Mm -hmm. So, we don't know. Yeah, which I is it. A huh? I drink a lot. You drink a lot? No. Okay. Are you still on drugs? Are you still on, like, no, the, the drink, crack and I stuff drink. like that? No. Because no? I see, like, the mouth open thing or whatever that a no, lot of, of yeah, crackheads no, do. No. Are you sure? I had a stroke <laughs> a while back when I had my first child. So, like, my mouth was walking, my eye. It was wide. Like, you could look at it. If you really look at it, mm. you could feel the difference. Yeah, I okay. had a stroke. So. Okay, I get it. I get and it. And by me, yeah, using drugs, you know, it's still like... A little like, bit messed up or whatever. Yeah. So, let, let's talk about some of this stuff. Oh, by the way, have you ever been married? No. No? Okay. So, let's just start from the beginning. Where are you from? New Orleans. You from New Orleans? <laughs> hey, man. Baby, say baby. Baby. <laughs> hey man, hey man, shout out that New Orleans, man. Oh, shout it out, man. That's my that's literally my second favorite city after Atlanta. Mm -hmm. I love New Orleans, man. I'm a foodie, so you know I love New Orleans. So anyway, all right, so growing up in New Orleans, did you have both mom and dad in the household? No. Who'd you grow up with? I grew up with my aunt and her 
hurricane. Speak up a little bit for me. My auntie and her kids. Okay, so you grew up with your auntie. Was that on your dad's side or your mom's side? Okay, so that was your mom's sister? Mm hmm And so what was the explanation or the reason for why your mom or dad my couldn't? My was on drugs at the time. Okay, so she, she was... Okay, so she was going through her uh, addictions. Uh-huh. And what about dad? I don't know. I never met him. Speak up. Never met him. Never met him? Okay, okay, okay. If Do you at least, like, kind of know his name and stuff like that? or So even if, like, you wouldn't even know, like, anything... If he passed you on the street, you wouldn't know him, wouldn't recognize him? Nope. What effect do you think that had on you growing up? It's a lot. Not having nailed one of them, it's a whole lot. What type of thoughts or questions would be going through your mind at that age? Like, why she took care of the other ones and why she didn't take care of me? Okay, so she had other kids? Yeah. And she was uh, raising those kids? Mm -hmm. But she had kind of sent you off to her sister? Huh. Mm -hmm. Did you ever get an explanation as to why that was? She never answered. She's like, she, my mama, and my mama really never seen how to highlight. like, so like, she really don't talk to me. He's like, we used to fight a lot. Okay. Is she still living? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is she clean now or is she still in her addiction? When's the last time you talked to her? Oh uh, my God. It's been a while. Over 10 years? Mm -hmm. Oh, three. Three? Three, four years. Three, four years? Um, I mean, how does that make you feel? It, 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 don't, it don't bother me no more because I, I let it go. I got my own kids, so therefore, it, it's like... Where do your kids live? Because you was just in prison for in four New, years. They huh? in New Orleans with their grandma and their grandma. With their grandma? And their grandma. The grandma on your side or...? or on their daddy's side. Okay, on their daddy's side? Okay, because you say they all have different dads. So are they all with different people or? They're with their grandma. Say it again? They're with their grandma and their grandpa on their daddy's side. <laughs> Not on my side. I get it, but you said that they all have yeah, different they dads. Have different dads. Okay, so are they all in the same place? No. Okay, they're all in different places. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Um, when was the last time you physically saw any of the kids? Uh I went and visited my son for Easter. Okay, so back mm -hmm. in April? And so before that, was had it been like years or whatever? Yeah, because I haven't seen it because I was locked up. What if and then I relapsed on alcohol? Relapsed on alcohol? Real bad. Ooh. I'm on a bad. Okay, and so, I mean, what is your relationship like with your kids? It's, it's there, but it's not like... The bond it's, isn't there? It's almost like my mama, you know, me not being there. Uh, Do you think they're resentful? Yeah, yeah. Hey, they, they, yeah, of course. Like I talked to my kids the other day, like today my daughter's birthday. I called her that day and she was like, oh my God, I just want to see you and give you a hug. And you know, she want to talk. And I'm like, I told her, she was like, just call me back. But she never answered. It is what it is. Yeah, it hurt, but there's nothing I can do about it. So let's, let's talk. So growing up in New Orleans, so, um, so you grew up with auntie and your cousins. Would you say that you had like a fairly normal childhood? I could say, yeah, not knowing that after like my auntie, okay, my mama's sister, knowing as me growing up in the house with her and her kids, I'm thinking she was my mother. You feel what I'm okay, so and what age did you find out that she wasn't? When she died. Uh, How old 99, were you? 99, 14. 14, yep. Ooh. So the whole so time. So you found that out at 14? Mm -hmm. How did that affect you when you found out that that wasn't your mom? It was a mess up because I used to always know my mama is my mother, who was my mother's sister, but the sister was always the one coming stealing from my mama. And she would just tell her, tell me that was my auntie. She never wanted me to know that she was my mother at the time. But when she passed away, her sister passed away and left me alone some of my money, now she want to appear. And from there, we never seen. How much money I, did she leave you? I can't remember. It was enough. Was it over twenty thousand? It was enough. I can't remember though. Okay. 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 So um, I'm gonna ask because of because of the way that your life has gone, right? Mm -hmm. um, when you were younger, did like anything like ever happen to you or anything like that? I'd have been raped. I'd have been shot up. I'd have been. What life. age? What age did that happen? Uh. Damn, I can't even think on that. Um, so, like, were you above middle school age or below middle I was, school age? I was, I was above. Okay, so you was like a teenager. I was like around the time when I was like drugging and shit. 
And so what happened? How did you end up getting R-worded? We don't say the word on YouTube, but how did you end up getting R-worded? <laughs> Being in the wrong place. So you was doing drugs and stuff like that? Mm -hmm. And I guess they just... No, taking advantage of you. Shit happens. So... Has it only is it only occurred one time or has it occurred it multiple occurred, times? It occurred a couple of times, but it was nothing that, that people could do about it because I was on drugs. Why so did like, you? What was, what, like what was it? Word against internet. Yeah, I get it. I mean, what was it that made you decide to 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 do drugs the first time? I wanted to know how I felt. I wanted to know what my mama didn't want to be in my life, so I wanted to know. I just stepped in us. So basically, you wanted to know. Well, what was so important with that, that kept you right from and yeah, now I can understand. I can understand. Well, do you regret trying yeah. that? Do you regret finding out? Hell yeah. Because now if your I'm kids old, your kids are having to go through the same thing that you went through. Same trauma. So how does that make you feel when you think about Clear. that? Clear. Clear. If if your kids were to happen to come across this video on YouTube, do you have a message for them? I tell them that I love them. And I'm sorry. Look them right here. They're looking. Look them in the eyes. Is it hard to face this reality? And, and it's not. It's not. Even, is it hard to like, like talk about the even actual? Even when I be like when I do go see my son. It's like we never even a party, you feel me? And I like that part. You never what? Like we never a party. Like when I did have my shirt, uh -huh. it's like when I go see him, it's like mine is mine. It's not like, you know, like how I was with my mom. I got to ask questions and why you did me this, why you did that. So it's not quite the do same. That. We still be, we be having fun. Like I never left. Right. So they kind of. And that's kind of and, and sweet to me, but so them, them, I know they hurt. You feel me? Well, yeah, they're definitely hurting, but them knowing the up. situation at least is a little bit better than what your situation was, where you just you just was complete under false uh, pretenses about what the situation was. True. Um, so I can see how there would be a difference, but I could also see where, like you said, they're probably experiencing a lot of pain mm -hmm. and trauma in regards to you. Oh, and so, I mean, what are we going to do to, you know, change that? Right now, when, uh, uh, I was just talking to uh, this lady. I was trying to get in Grady, but yeah, look at me. Why you can't look at me? Because you don't want to look. You don't want to see this. You don't want to. It's sometimes it's hard to, to face in. this, right? Oh my god! I'm trying to get into a a, a, a who a, a program. So yeah. the voice or whatever. Why is the voice kind of? You have the the uh, voice I where drink people that and I yell. I, so. I you say what? I buck. <laughs> you buck? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean you buck? You know what I'm saying? Like me and my old man, we be fighting. <laughs> you be what? We be fighting. <laughs> so I be yelling at him. Why do you be fighting with your old man? Hello. Is he homeless as well? So. Huh? Yes, you can But he not my old man. He not your old man right now? Not right now. Hell Maybe no. later on the day though, right? <laughs> no. Huh? Game over. Game over? Yeah. Okay, okay. So, okay, so the bottom line is that um, you're out here, you know what I'm saying? You kind of, you still have your alcohol addiction going on, but you're saying that, when's the last time, be honest, because we do ask for truth and transparency mm -hmm. in this channel. When's the last time you did smoke crack? Uh, I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, I relapsed on East. I have got. I don't uh, the mega bus. Yep. So after you left the kids, left. or before you got there, after, after you left. But I when I when I came out, I did it for almost about a week. I just started drinking. What made you decide to stop smoking crack? Just stop. Well, most people can't just stop. So that's what it's I'm saying. Not, like, it's not good like it used to be. That shit trash. Oh, so it's just not hitting? Oh, not hitting the way? So if it was hitting like it was. I probably, <laughs> need, I probably wouldn't even be right here. <laughs> Home go. No, I get it. I get it, man. I get it. I yeah. get it. Okay, okay. So, okay. Because like I say, what are you going to do to get out of this situation? I'm, I'm, right now, I'm trying to find help. You're trying to find help? Yeah. In, in the form of what? Uh, speak up for me. The resource right here, Gateway. I can't hear you, girl. You oh, speak it all low. It's hot. 
It ain't hot. Come over here in the shade. Come over here in the shade. You stay right there. All right. No, you stay. You stay. <laughs> okay, okay. But no, so. yeah, I'm, I'm trying to get some help. Okay, okay, I, I get it. I've been talking to the people here. So they, and you mean like, he's, this paper's this way. I've been calling, and it's like, I don't know. These motherfuckers down here don't I mean, you got to put one foot in front of the other out here. These people down here don't help you with shit. Man. Well, it, the help is there, but you do have to go through the process. Yes, you know what I'm saying? And the process ain't fun all the time. All I can so. do is be patient. Okay. All right, well, listen, miss. We really appreciate you taking the time answering all of our yeah. questions. If anybody out there wanted to reach out, help, or donate, do you have a way they could do that? Do you have social media, cash app, anything like that? <laughs> Dollar sign Peggy Ellaby. Who? Peggy Ellaby. Peggy Ellaby? You look like a Peggy Ellaby. <laughs> you look like a Peggy Ellaby. And so, do you have an IG or Facebook or anything? I got a Facebook. What's your Facebook? Penelope Martinez. Who? Penelope Martinez. <laughs> Penelope yeah. Martinez. Okay, is that your? That's you. Yeah. Okay, are you? What's your background? What's your racial background? What's me? Um, black, Mexican, Mexican, white, Mexican. huh? Mexican. Black, blackskin. <laughs> that's what they call it, blackskin. Yeah. Okay, okay, I see it. I see you got the gray hairs coming in. My, my, I grayed early as well, so I, I know how it is. The people sometimes think you're older. <laughs> it happens, it happens. All right, well, listen, like I say, we really appreciate you. Mm -hmm. And we definitely wish you nothing but the best out here, all right? <laughs> you make sure you have no, a good one, okay, sweetie? Yeah, you too. All right.